It is currently springtime, meaning it is the best time to fertilize your stone fruit trees and get lush green foliage and nice fruit. Okay, so as you can see, my nectarine tree already has leaves and I was a little bit late to fertilize it. So if I can find a good spot right here, all right, if you can look hard enough, you can see some yellow leaves. So if you wanna talk about when to fertilize a tree, make sure that you fertilize it whenever it starts budding and there are new leaves and flowers. So you need to do it a little bit earlier than mine, but now we're gonna show you how real quick. So how to fertilize a peach tree. I measured my finger, this first sector right here, the first bendy part, this thing would be an inch. So if I put it right here, about half of it comes across that, meaning that my finger, I mean that the trunk is half an inch in diameter. So what I'm gonna do is for every inch of diameter, you need a pound of fertilizer. So I'm only gonna need a pound of it, meaning that I need roughly a cup. So what I have is, um, I know that I gotta get new fertilizer, but I got 646 fertilizer for uh, citrus trees. It's pretty well balanced, so it's okay that I use this. And I'm going to use a cup of it because that is roughly half a pound. Okay, let's do this. All right, I'm getting a full cup. Okay, so quickly off camera, this tree was recently transplanted, so there's some loose soil here that I'm going to dig out, but what you guys are going to want to do is just sprinkle it around the soil, not on the trunk, but then you're going to scrape it in, and you're going to give it a water, and I'll show you how to in a moment. Okay, so now that it's like this, you can see that some roots are showing, and you'll want it to look just like this when you're doing it. So now I'm going to spread it evenly. Now, I'm gonna be right back because I need to go get a tool to dig it in. Okay, now it's just to cover it back up with the soil. Okay, so now for the last and one of the most important parts, you need to water it. However, there is already a little bit of moisture in my soil, so I'm not gonna do it much. All right, there we go. That's how to fertilize your stone fruits. If you liked the video, please like and subscribe. Thanks for watching. Goodbye.